Good morning and welcome to Monday. Our subject today again from Italy. This photo I took uh, in Fabriano, you know that small town. I was there three times and all the time I enjoy it. It's a pretty simple. There is no perspective, there is no construction. It's a very simple sketch and just very nice light. Let's try to do that. I changed my composition a little bit because the portrait position it's not nice for the video recording that's why I make it a little bit like a square and this is the piece of the Fabriano rough paper because we are painting Fabriano and I'm gonna use the spray in the beginning to make it a little bit wet and uh, let's start I like the wall what we have here and I'm gonna make this wall in few steps. You don't have to be fast like me for this. I'm just trying to save you time. So you can make it slowly and enjoy the, the process. Our 15 minutes paintings, we all the time making something like a sketch. I mean, you don't have to be serious about that. You know, in the comments, I'm all the time so that, like you say, you make it so simple. You know, it is simple. I can tell you the secret. Don't be serious. Enjoy the process. Take a fun and play with water. If you're gonna do that, that will be simple. Like usual I'm painting by my three favorite colors and this time I add just a little bit Queen Credon deep gold in that.
and I choose that paper because of the two reasons. First, because it's a Fabriano, and second, because this paper drying very fast and I want to make the fast sketch in few layers. That's why the fast drying paper make my job more simple. I like that old wall. You know, uh, if we're not talking about the sketch, if I will have uh, more time for that, I can play with that wall a few hours. I like it. In order to make the old wall like that, we have to play just with the, in one game. The shadow on the bottom, the light on top. Just following that system and that will be easy to do. We're still not creating the shadows, we're just playing with the texture of the paper. The shadows we're gonna do a little bit late. few more touching before we start to create our big shadow and the, the lamp itself. You see, I'm all the time broke the lines. I don't make it look perfect. That's important because we're not talking about the modern downtown. We're ta talking about something very old and that's why. Don't finish it the shape. Don't make it look perfect. Play with this.
when I'm starting to make the shadow first and after that we create our lamp. So for the shadow I mix again just the indigo and the queen sienna We can add a little bit more purple pigments inside to make it more interesting. I'm going to blend it somewhere just to make it look better. and uh, collect the other water here you see I make here a big lake because I need the time to, to work with that but for this I have to finish that first I'll do my best to keep it like one long big shadow everywhere gonna connect it to my subjects because that's the the same shadow for everything right and to make it look better somewhere I make wash out to make some nice reflection inside Perfect. So before we start to create our lamp, I just make that black window here. And for this I just take the neutral tint.
and like usual I'm gonna blend it somewhere just to save you time I'm gonna use the hair dryer again but personally I don't like that stuff In the end I will take my solo travel brush, very pointy and just perfect for this job. We're gonna back to this to put some details then it will be dry. For now I just make a few touching here to bring a little bit more light to my painting. And like I say, we finish it our lamp just to put the more darker touch in here. Because even if we're talking about the black stuff, the black stuff still can take the light. Few more touching. Okay, and the last step, like usual. Well, do you know what we did in the end? We create the urban sketch without perspective. Thank you for your time. Like usual, all my materials, including my solo brush, you can find on my website, as well like a lot of videos, watercoloronline.com, and definitely, see you next Monday. Stay healthy. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give us a like and subscribe to my channel. Bye.